Hi guys and welcome back to the Cassie Projects. So in this week's video we're going to be doing another episode of Wreck This Journal. I'm going to be doing one page today, Crack This Spine, and it's actually a page where I completed the prompt but I didn't actually draw anything on the pages. So I, I, I did, I did crack the spine, I think in my first video. First we need to crack that spine, look away if you don't like seeing this but I can't really show you the pages unless we do that. But I didn't draw anything, because I just didn't feel inspired at that moment. But but today, I do, and it's going to be uh, the anatomy of a spine, and I'm really excited. On the black page, I'm going to use white gel pen, so it stands out on the black. And then on the white, I'm going to be using black pen. So I just think it's going to be really cool. Let's crack on. <laughs> I didn't even mean to do that. Crack on with crack the spine. <laughs> so I found a few pictures of spines and I want to draw the full length of spine on the white page. But to make it a little bit more interesting, I want to have flowers growing out of the different spine nooks and crannies. So it's going to be like, almost like a weedy kind of, a few like wild flowers coming through. I'm going to do the full length of the spine. So we've got the cervical, the thoracic, the lumbar, the sacrum and the co coccyx. So yeah, I'm just going to have flowers growing out of the different vertebrae. And um, yeah, I just think it will look quite quirky and fun. So the fountain pen that I've got, it is a Hongdian 517D and it's got a bent nib on it. So this allows me to do thicker lines and thinner lines. Now the ink that I use is a platinum carbon ink in black and that is a completely waterproof ink. Then if I want a splash of colour on the flowers, I could put a little bit of watercolour on them. And then on the black page, I want to do a close-up of the crack in the spine. So one of the, I need to look up the words, uh, the vertebrae. It's vertebrae, isn't it? So is each one a vertebrae? So yeah, I want to show the real cracks. I might just do a close-up of two or three vertebrae and show the real good crack in it, crack the spine. I have got my Sakura Jelly Roll white gel pen. It's got number eight on it. Does that mean that's the size of it? Can you get different sizes? I didn't know this. I need to look that up. You can. I just, I, I just, I'd never even thought about that, that, that number on there. Does anyone use some different sizes? Uh, do they work as well? So this one's a number eight and it is nice and smooth. It works nicely. I like it. Um, but it would be cool to have a finer point. I always like a fine point. So yeah, so that's what I'm going to use on the black. I know that that works because I did it on another page in the right, this journal, which was the draw on the back of an envelope. So I created an envelope, um, but then on the left page, it was a dark blue page. So then I used the white gel pen and it worked amazingly. So you may be wondering why I've been doing shorter videos the last couple of weeks. That's because my darling husband was in hospital really quite poorly yeah it was a really hard time but I've realized that we do too much we rush too much we're always in a hurry when I plan too much in a video I enjoy it less I don't get as much out of it whereas if I just plan to do one page out of my journals I enjoy it so much more and I think it's a lot less stressful for me so I hope that that's okay I hope that you're okay with me doing shorter videos here and there. I will have some longer videos as well. Um, but yeah, my main thing is to make sure I'm posting every week and uh, more importantly, looking after myself. Well, 
Well, there you go. That is this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I really did. I really, really enjoyed that. I love just sitting and drawing sometimes and just being creative and having a bit of time to myself and a bit of quiet, just a bit of drawing. Beautiful. Anyway, I'll see you next week. Bye. If like me, you like getting creative, uh, not just art, not just crafts, but even if it's DIY or baking or gardening, whatever you're into that allows you to get creative, then feel free to come and join my uh, Facebook group. It's called Cassie's Creativity Club. And basically we just share our artwork. We encourage each other, inspire each other. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate the support and I'll see you all next week. Bye.